Hi, my name is Britt. And I'm Jennifer, and we're from Sprig. And we're at the Sundance Film Festival in Park City, Utah. And we're looking for things that are green, including... Celebrities! Celebrities, and they're everywhere. And we're going to find out, if we can find them, what they're doing that's green. And what their eco sin is. Here we go. Let's go look. Come on! I think we're right here. <laughs> One of my ways of trying to deal with my guilt is I, I've invested in a, in a new uh, store which is about to open in London, which is an eco retail store, sort of an eco solution store. Oh, I drive electric cars. I drive, well, I have a Prius, so I'm doing that, but I have a, between the solar panels that are up on the roof of my, uh, my office and the two electric cars that I drive, my, my, the main car that's driven by my office is a Toyota electric uh, EV1, RAV electric. It's got 40,000 miles on it. All electric powered, not a, not, a, not a drop of gas. All of our household products are now biodegradable and non-toxic. We just did it in the past two months. Yeah. I think it, uh, good, good things to do are things like um, you boil only enough water for what you need. I mean, how often do you kind of boil a full kettle and it just goes to waste and it's such a waste of power. And Everyone's like, I don't like twice boiled water. Well, I carpool every chance I get and I'm living in... Uh, uh, Australia right now and it's a very environmentally friendly city and uh, you know I walk everywhere I can. I've lived in New York City now for 16 years and haven't owned a car for 16 years so it's pretty great. We recycle. I, I have a hybrid. My eco sins I don't know I travel a lot so that's quite a an imprint but that's not really a sin is it? Oh I burn giant plastic jugs in my backyard uh, but that's not that big of a deal. My carbon footprint's pretty shameful, probably. Um, you know, I, I, how do you think I got here? Really, it wasn't on a camel. I drink gasoline. <laughs> Raw gasoline. <laughs> actually, I, I think I have too many bottles of water. Yeah, that's, that's actually true. Yeah. They should start making them from, from, uh, from glass, right? I know. If it's raining outside, I did drive my Vespa to the supermarket and I could have walked it. And I didn't wear a helmet. Yeah, I really sinned out that day. Yeah. yeah. I lost sleep and, you know, cried about it, but, you know. I'm, I'm like a tech freak, like a gadget, a gadget whore, and I've got all these products that are in a drawer at home that once you're done with this, where do they go? I don't want to toss it because I don't want to just end up in a landfill somewhere. Well, see, I drive, I drive a car. I mean, I sleep with a fan, so I, I waste a little, some energy. I, I, I just need like the, the, the noise, the white noise to drown out extraneous noises. Oh man, that's a good question. Uh, you know, uh, yeah, I, I probably could get by without newspapers. You know, even though we recycle them, I probably could get everything off the web. But it's no fun to sit in front of the, you know, with a cup of coffee holding your, holding your computer. You got to have that tactile feeling of the actual newsprint and getting it on your hands. That, that would be my biggest sin. At least that's what I'm going to claim is my biggest sin. Thank you Enjoy so much. That.